Let's play redactyl number 436 on Friday, June 16th. Immediately I'm seeing a lot of uh, hyphens. The title is 7 of 8. 7, 7, 7, uh, 9, the 7, so something like officially. Oh, I want, oh, could it be uh, the Republic? But then we have 3, 7, 2 dash 3, 7, 2, the 7, 5, circa 2, 2 dash 3. Oh, maybe it's uh, formerly, no, that's eight letters. Uh, previously, the 6, 9, 3 dash 3. Could these be year ranges? Uh, with the, if that is circa, um, the 5, and that's 3 to 3, and 6, 6, 10, also 3 to 3, and 6, 5, the 4 of 7 dash 3. Well, that's not a date range, 8. The 6, 6, 3, 4, a 4, another hyphenated word, a 4, 8, uh, self something 8. Um, oh, and Republic has eight letters, not seven. Uh, so maybe it is a something, a self-governing, a self-something Republic. Uh, something and six known as the four, seven. Now this could be a date range straddling the year 1000. Oops, and a five, eight, and eight of five, five. 8, 5, and the 7, 3, 7, 3, 4. Um, so maybe Kingdom of something in some years. 7, 4 was 4 to 5, the 6, 6, something into a 8, 5 which went on to something uh, the six six after the dissolution of the something empire eight four to be something well I'm wondering if it's a European I'm very Eurocentric, I admit. Uh, could be a Chinese dynasty. Not sure what else it could be. Let's look for anything else here. Oh my goodness, this is a very long article. This might be one of the longest we've had in a while. Um, but I think again, some years, maybe AD. During the six the something era, the something age, which is not estimated, but something to be about so many years old. Oh, what is this hyphenated phrase? Two to two dash four dash three. Oh, I cannot think of what would those two letter words be. Oh, I think it just actually it might be just two numbers. Was a like um, 20 to 40 year old man. It's something. Let's try man. It is a man. Um, with 5-4, before the 4-7, yeah, I don't know, in the 1-3 something, in for the something of a 8-5,
the um, the remains, the bo the bones of a something into something across seven toward something. Uh, that might be into the east. Oh no, there we have these. How about to the west? Okay, across seven. So that a river toward well, let's try France. No France. How about Russia? Oh, I would have expected Russia in the east. Eight Russia. Something Russia against the four six. Seven five against Russia without the help of something by eight between eight Russia. What is an adjective for Russia? Well, I suppose maybe northern, southern. On some date, the seven six and eight six um, maybe fought a something battle without the something of something. Five of eight by Russia. Let's try war. Twenty wars. Yeah, I think this is definitely a history one. Among the five, six was that of the four, and then one apostrophe one dash two. One apostrophe one. Yikes. Okay. To the something and something war between him. In a five four war, a war with a three seven, a war with the new romantics uh, was an something of war. Ooh, the six five. Okay, so that the thirty years war no. No, the six five war was uh, fought between the three eight between the the who fought against the something. Let me go up to the top and see if any of these words have shown up here. We do have East. So how about Far East? Yes. And the 7-3, 7 Far East. I do want to try Kingdom. I thought that might appear. There is four occurrences. Um, there are four, four occurrences. They do C for circa. That's the only C. Seven, seven, seven. And then something the seven. Let's try AD. Yeah. I wonder what can come between the 2-3, if that's a two-digit year spanning to a three-digit year, but then what would come between those years and AD, seven-letter word? I don't think it's century, although I think century will appear. Oh, it is um, century. 
So, so maybe it's uh, first. Ah. Oh, so sorry, it's something century BC. How about second? No. Third? There we go. Ah, so it was the something from the third century BC, the first century AD. And then it became the seven five. The six nine. The five and six six ten and six. Let's look at our kingdoms. In uh, its kingdom, his kingdom, let's do her kingdom, just to see. We do have his and hers. He was um, assassinated, uh, succeeded, succeeded. I think is more likely. He was succeeded eventually. No, uh, succeeded something by his son. Four, six. So let's do king. No. Um, anyway, let's look at our kings. Ah, uh, at this. Something six four was crowned. No, the five four, and then a single character with some language for king. Is that the letter R? No, is it uh, Russian? Wouldn't be Spanish. Um, what could it be? By the, oh, by the god something? No. In his kingdom with the something of something. All right, let's look at our other kings. Kings of the Wild Frontier, no king of the something something. Four king. Okay. I'm going to look at hers. As she was. Something and something to her seven. Is in her something. I'm not sure this is really helping me. But I just think it would be unusual to have a her in this time period who is so important. Um, Eight eleven Russian something. Let's do queen. Queen something the uh, the good? No. It's funny queen is not capitalized here. And we have queen. Uh, is it Elizabeth? No. Christina? No. Um, let's look at my Russians. Oh, so it is the Russian Far East. Ah, the 7 3. Well, let me look for Chinese. 62. Against the six of the nine Chinese uh, dynasty. Well, we do have, a, oh, we have a lot of dynasties, including uh, the very first paragraph. Well, of course, the obvious one is the Ming 
dynasty. No, they are mentioned 28 times. Is there something dynasty? And the 7 3 Russian Far East. I'm wondering if this sentence is about the extent of this territory. I'm thinking it must be a kingdom, some geographic area. Let me try country just to see. A something something one of the most seven five of the country. Uh, times no the six of the six four seven and four in the seven five who oh, have a rain we do have some rains until the reign of somebody the second no fourth sixth no eleventh ninth oh I'm giving up on that now um We did have, ah, I was doing it as 11, but all right. So this maybe explains that funny apostrophe we saw earlier. Um, so what would be in the Russian Far East beside China, maybe? Um, what would some names for former places there be seven the second after his something year rain yeah I think I need to find the place which may in fact be in the title um Have a mandarin, my favorite kind of orange. No. Um, Shanghai, eight letters. No. Hmm. Um, have I done empire yet? Ah, okay. An empire, or maybe founded an empire. Yes. The six six, maybe who, who, something a four dash a self. No, or maybe self appointed or something. Founded an empire known as the something dynasty. What dynasty is that? And five, eight, and eight. Hmm. The six, six. The something family? No, there is a single family. And his something family. The four empire again. Well, four dynasty up here, four empire. Um, let's do China. Ah, okay. And something of uh, North China. Let's do South as well. And uh, northern, there we go, southern, oh, maybe northern India. No, northern, 
uh, Korea. Aha. Uh -huh. And the seven threes. Oh, okay. I'm trying to think if I know the names of any northern Chinese provinces that might have been independent at one time or part of a different empire. Um, I wonder if Sino is going to be in there. There is a single Sino. Sino 6. Uh, Sino Korean. No, we do have two Koreans from the Korean something in the east across the northern half. No, the northern part. No. Um, let's see, I did northern, southern. I don't think I've done eastern. There we go. Western. Eastern, maybe parts of um, Thailand. Thailand is not mentioned. Is Japan mentioned just three times? Nine sixes, eight, four, four. In his um, travels or journey. Oops, forgot my M. No, we do have one travels. Between the seven and three Chinese. Uh, the new, old, a new something and something following the, not annexation, but let's put that in. Only ten letters, no. Uh, invasion. Nine invasions. Uh, maybe when the Chinese launched you know, an invasion of the seven across the six five from the four Chinese army. along the northern uh, border the something of the seven empire was six he was succeeded something by his son the something of the something empire was somebody Oh, I wonder if uh, Genghis Khan is probably too late for this. We do have a, a lot of Genghis, so maybe not. Genghis Khan, oh, the very guy. Oh, um, Mongol, 72. Oh, have I? I thought I did Empire. Oops. Uh, I did do Empire, oh, it was right there. Um, the Mongol uh, something, but let me go up. So, okay. Um, the something dynasty. So Genghis Khan is right there. So how about Mongolia? Ah, so this is like one we had before, I think. Oh, of course, yes. Very like ones for its history of. It only took me 88 words to remember. Oh, yeah, history of something. I think it was history of Poland we had before. Uh, so let's try history of Mongolia. There we go. So there have been 39 players. Uh, the median is 67, the average is 85, so I'm just a little below average. Yeah, there's something about the f 
just this type of article that always puts me off and I, I never think of history of. And I really, when I see seven of something, I should immediately think history of. Yeah, it's a funny start to the article, various nomadic empires, including, here we go, all of these different ones, I'm not going to try pronouncing, rule the area of, ah, present day is the hyphenated word, uh, para-Mongolic language, well, and there we go, 1206, he was able to unite the Mongol tribes, he yeah, was very just fortunate, I thought, of Genghis. And then Genghis Khan, well, he's the, the only Genghis I know. Maybe there's a Genghis O'Reilly somewhere. Um, all right, well, uh, not one of my best performances, but uh, at least I got it before the 30-minute mark. I hope you did better than I did. Thanks, as always, for watching, and have a great day.